Yes, this is Ghetto Free Press, and uh, I'm up here at the Mayor Turner, a historic marker, and we have a couple people here. And this is what I often say, that if people would just, the city and county could uh, put this on the historic marker and stuff, they very possibly could make uh, money on giving tours. You have uh, the other people that were lynched. You got the old county jail over there in Brooks County. And uh, what's your name, my brother? Glenn. Glenn Allen. And what's your name? Man? Sylvia Allen. What do you all think about from what you heard about the lynching of Mayor Turner? What's your opinion of it? I think it was an atrocity uh, to a human being. She was a human being, not just uh, a black woman. And I think um, that more people should be aware of what happened, how it happened, how she was lynched in this area. It's, it's uh, American history, not just African American history, but it's American history and children, today's children, and even the ones who never even um, studied American history or African American history should be made aware. All right, thank you very much. I think this book speaks to the brutality of what our ancestors were subjected to. This was something was unimaginable in terms of, of maybe just hearing about situations like this as opposed to something that's truly documented as what actually did happen. So to more or less, I've heard about this for a long time, but to now see it in terms of the actual location of where this thing took place it makes it more real. So now it's like something that needs to be needs to be seen by more folks because I've been past this road hundreds of times but I didn't know this was an actual location so it kind of more or less just makes it more 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 realistic in terms of what actually did happen. Five mm -hmm. Obviously some white person tried to kill this woman again. And it Just speaks, by shooting her memorial. Yeah, and it speaks to the kind of hatred that was truly in place. And still, there are residuals of that that exist today. Yeah. So we can't more or less take our foot off the pedal as to what's going on in terms of letting people know what their responsibility is as opposed to what our ancestors were were subjected to in terms of what they had to go through for for survival. Very survival. Okay, once again, this is the Get To Free Press. I'm George Boston Ryans, and uh, I just want to thank you all for having the something in your brain cells that want to come and check out history. You know, a lot of people don't want to have nothing to do with it. They say they can't stand the pain and nor depression. But uh, I'm glad you all was able to come up. And uh, and when you look at it, think about there's uh, a group called the Mary Turner Project. You can Google them on the internet. So every opportunity that I get, people ask for tours. I've given tours down in uh, Rain, uh, Rosewood, Florida. Yeah. And whenever the university have asked me to give a tour on that. So when somebody come by to want to learn, I try to do what I can. And by the way, uh, Mr. Ransom here, he's, he's been up here last time with me and, and we had an outstanding uh, a visit. So I just want to thank you all for coming and may God bless you. May have a, and, and once again, always remember Google the May Returner Project and, and you'll see more than this because Professor Mark George, and he's from this area, uh, he uh, spearheaded this and we must commend Dr. Mark George. He's no longer here. He out west now, I think. But we want to thank him for the work that he's done. He's a Caucasian brother, too. Uh -huh. But his heart is in the right place. So we want to commend him and all the students with university uh, students. We must commend them, and we'll never forget you. And once again, to get our free press, George Boss Ryan, we report what others ignore. Peace. Excuse me, before you go, I want to ask you a question. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, what are those other things up there moving away? What? That's my eye candy. That's it, who? My eye candy. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, all right. Y'all have a nice one, okay? Thank y'all so much. That's your eye candy, huh? Eye candy. Boy, there we go again, y'all. There we go again. Check them out. Check them out. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. 
call you. They non-stop. They non-stop. They non-stop. You got Sam in that. They non-stop. <laughs> That's my eye candy. That's a who? My eye candy. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, all right. Y'all have a nice one, okay? Thank y'all so much. That's your eye candy, huh? Eye candy. Boy, there we go again, y'all. There we go again. Check them out. Check them out. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, you. They non-stop. You non-stop. You got Sam in that. They non-stop. <laughs>